Adrien Marie Legendre was a French mathematician. Legendre made numerous contributions to mathematics. Well known and important concepts such as the Legendre polynomials and Legendre transformation are named after him. Life Adrien Marie Legendre was born in Paris on 18 September 1752 to a wealthy family. He received his education at the College Mazarin in Paris, and defended his thesis in physics and mathematics in 1770. He taught at the École Militaire in Paris from 1775 to 1780 and at the École Normale from 1795. At the same time, he was associated with the Bureau des Longitudes. In 1782, the Berlin Academy awarded Legendre a prize for his treatise on projectiles in resistant media. This treatise also brought him to the attention of Lagrange. The Académie des Sciences made Legendre an adjoint member in 1783 and an associé in 1785. In 1789 he was elected a Fellow of the Royal Society. He assisted with the Anglo-French survey to calculate the precise distance between the Paris Observatory and the Royal Greenwich Observatory by means of trigonometry. To this end in 1787 he visited Dover and London together with Dominique Comte de Cassini and Pierre Metchain. The three also visited William Herschel, the discoverer of the planet Uranus. Legendre lost his private fortune in 1793 during the French Revolution. That year, he also married Marguerite Claudine Cuhin, who helped him put his affairs in order. In 1795 Legendre became one of six members of the mathematics section of the reconstituted Académie des Sciences, renamed the Institut National des Sciences et des Arts. Later, in 1803, Napoleon reorganized the Institut National, and Legendre became a member of the geometry section. From 1799 to 1812, Legendre served as mathematics examiner for graduating artillery students at the École Militaire and from 1799 to 1815 he served as permanent mathematics examiner for the École Polytechnique. In 1824, Legendre was denied his pension from the École Militaire because he refused to vote for the government candidate at the Institut National, the Comte de Corbière, Ministre de l'Interieur of the Ultra-Royalist Government. His pension was partially reinstated with the change in government in 1828. In 1831 he was made an officer of the Legend d'Honneur. Legendre died in Paris on 10 January 1833, after a long and painful illness, and Legendre's widow carefully preserved his belongings to memorialize him. Upon her death in 1856, she was buried next to her husband in the village of Autoy, where the couple had lived, and left their last country house to the village. Legendre's name is one of the 72 names inscribed on the Eiffel Tower. Scientific activity. Most of his work was brought to perfection by others. His work on roots of polynomials inspired Galois' theory. Abel's work on elliptic functions was built on Legendre's, some of Gauss' work in statistics, and number theory completed that of Legendre. He developed the least squares method and firstly communicated it to his contemporaries before Gauss which has broad application in linear regression, signal processing, statistics, and curve fitting. This was published in 1806 as an appendix to his book on the paths of comets. Today, the term least squares method is used as a direct translation from the French method des mots and des carres. Around 1811 he named the gamma function and introduced the symbol gamma normalizing it to gamma equals n. In 1830 he gave a proof of Fermat's last theorem for exponent n equals 5, which was also proven by Lejeune de Riclet in 1828. In number theory, he conjectured the quadratic reciprocity law, subsequently proved by Gauss, in connection to this. The Legendre symbol is named after him. He also did pioneering work on the distribution of primes, and on the application of analysis to number theory. His 1798 conjecture of the prime number theorem was rigorously proved by Hadamard and L. R. Vallée-Poussin in 1896. 
Legendre did an impressive amount of work on elliptic functions, including the classification of elliptic integrals, but it took Abel's stroke of genius to study the inverses of Jacobi's functions and solve the problem completely. He is known for the Legendre transformation, which is used to go from the Lagrangian to the Hamiltonian formulation of classical mechanics. In thermodynamics it is also used to obtain the enthalpy and the Helmholtz and Gibbs energies from the internal energy. He is also the name giver of the Legendre polynomials, solutions to Legendre's differential equation, which occur frequently in physics and engineering applications, e.g., electrostatics. Legendre is best known as the author of Elements de Geometry which was published in 1794 and was the leading elementary text on the topic for around 100 years. This text greatly rearranged and simplified many of the propositions from Euclid's elements to create a more effective textbook, Portrait de Barcle, for two centuries, until the recent discovery of the error in 2005, books. Paintings and articles have incorrectly shown a side view portrait of the obscure French politician Louis Legendre as that of the mathematician Legendre. The error arose from the fact that the sketch was labeled simply Legendre and appeared in a book along with contemporary mathematicians such as Lagrange. The only known portrait of Legendre, recently unearthed, is found in the 1820 book album de 73 portraits charge aquarelles des membres de l'Institut, a book of caricatures of 73 members of the Institut de France in Paris by the French artist Julien Leopold Boy is shown below. Honours Foreign honorary member of the American Academy of Arts and Sciences the moon crater Legendre is named after him. Main belt asteroid 26950 Legendre is named after him. Legendre is one of the 72 prominent French scientists who were commemorated on plaques at the first stage of the Eiffel Tower when it first opened. Publications Essay 1782 Recherches sur la trajectoire des projectiles dans les milieux résistants Books Elements de Geometry, Textbook 1794, Essay sur la théorie des nombres 1797-8, 2nd ed. 1808, 3rd ed. In two volume, 1830, Nouvelles méthodes pour la détermination des orbites des cometes, 1805, Exercises de calcul intégral, book in three volumes, 1811, 1817, and 1819. Traité des functions elliptics, book in three volumes 1825, 1826, and 1830. Memoirs in Histoire de l'Académie Royale des Sciences 1783 sur l'attraction des spheroides homogenes. 1784 Recherches sur la figure des planètes p. 370. 1785 Recherches in Termine p. 465, 1786 Memoir sur la manière de distinguer les maxima des minima dans le calcul des variations p. 7, 1786 Memoir sur les integrations par arcs de lips p. 616, 1786 Second Memoir sur les integrations par arcs de p. 644, 1787 L'integration de quelques equations aux différences partiels. In Memoirs Présentes par divers savants à la l'Académie des Sciences de l'Institut de France 1806 Nouvelle formula pour réduire en distances vrais. Les distances apparentes de la lune au soleil à une étoile. 1807 Analyse des triangles tracés sur la surface de un sphéroïde. Tome 10 Recherches sur diverses sortes d'intégrales des fines. 1819 Method des mots des carres pour trouver le milieu le plus probable entre les résultats de différentes observations. Memoir sur l'attraction des ellipsoides homogenes. 1823 Recherches sur quelques objets d'analyse indéterminés et particulièrement sur le terreau de Fermat. 
1828 Memoir sur la détermination des fonctions y a z k satisfont to l'équation 4 equals n et un nombre premier 4 i plus 1. 1833 Reflections sur différentes manières de démontrer la théorie des parallèles à la terre sur la somme des trois angles de triangle, avec one planche.